Hey guys, it's Bridget. Welcome back to my channel. So today I have another Halloween video for you guys. If you didn't see my latest or my first Halloween video for this year, I will have it right here. Make sure to check it out. It was all about like a Beyonce look from her Lemonade visual album. So that was super fun to film. So go check that out if you haven't. But today I'm showing you guys 21 different, no, tw yeah, what? 21 DIY last minute costumes for Halloween. All of these really are super easy to make. Some of them, like actually most of them I had everything for at my house, but a few things, like a few of them I had to go out and buy a few things for, but all the things I bought weren't expensive at all. So they're super easy, super cheap. I am the person who every year like decides on Halloween what to be. So if you're like me, this video should help you out a lot. Before I get started, if you're new to my channel, make sure to click that subscribe button down below so you don't miss out on my future Halloween videos. I have a few more and I'm really excited for you guys to see them. So don't forget to click that button down below. And if you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up so I know. And with that being said, let's go to the video. So the first costume idea is a baseball player. All you need is leggings, some kind of baseball jersey, and a hat. The next one is a kiwi, which I think would be super cute if like you and your friends were all different kinds of fruit. But all I did was got a lime green shirt, cut out a bunch of black seeds on black cardboard paper, and then just got like a light green for the core of the fruit. The next one is a self-portrait, which you guys, this is probably like the easiest. You just have to dress in a normal outfit and carry around a picture frame with you. Super easy. Next step is a football player. Once again, just leggings, a jersey, and you can carry around a football. For this rosy costume, all you have to wear are black pants, a denim shirt, and a red bandana. So to be an M&M, all you have to do is have black leggings, any colored shirt, and cut out a white M&M. This would be another really cute one with a group if you guys all want to do like the different colors of M&Ms. Next up, I did a hashtag sign, which is super easy. All you have to do is wear all black and then just get cardboard, cut it out, and make it in the shape of a hashtag, and then paint it white. And yeah, that's pretty much it. For this birthday present costume, all you have to get is a really big gift bag, fill it with some tissue paper, and wear a ribbon in your hair. Next up, I did a sports fan, which I had everything of this at home besides the little face sticker, which was literally only 99 cents at Michael's, but I think it is super cute and easy. Next up, I did a Pinterest board, so I just wore all black and then just got some pieces of cork board and printed out some pictures from Pinterest and just tagged them on. Next up, I did a robber costume, so I just wore black pants, a white and black striped shirt, I got a pillowcase, and then this black like eye mask from Michaels. This next costume has to be one of my favorites. You just have to wear a animal onesie and then cut out a red heart and put the TY Beanie Baby logo on it. To look like a frat guy, all you have to do is wear very preppy clothes, so I just have pink shorts on, a white button-up, and a Ralph Lauren hat. To be a nurse, all you have to do is get some scrubs and then you can also wear any medical equipment. So I have a stethoscope on and that's it. For this costume, all you're going to have to do is get a very big white shirt or a dress and then a bunch of styrofoam balls. Cut them in half and paint them different colors and I tape them on but I will recommend like hot gluing them down so they stay on throughout the whole night. To be a marathon runner, all you have to do is wear running shorts, a workout top, a headband, and then print out one of like the running label card thingies. I don't know what they're called. For ballerina, all you have to do is get a very big like white tutu, and then I just wear a light pink shirt. And I would also recommend wearing tights and flats. To be a twister board, all you have to do is get a big white shirt and then cut out a bunch of circles of the colors of the board, which are red, yellow, green, and blue, and just glue them to your shirt. For this jelly bean costume, I just wore all black and then got this clear poncho and filled it up with all different colored balloons and I also printed out the jelly bean logo and taped it on. To be a basic girl, all you have to do are wear leggings, I also wear Uggs but you can't see, and then this pink like oversized sweater, this LA hat, and of course a Starbucks cup. And then my last costume is a queen bee, so I just wear black leggings, this yellow tutu, white and black shirt, and then I just have this gold little crown. 
So that was it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up if you did. And let me know which costume idea you like the best. Or if you're going to be any of these for Halloween, let me know down below. Also, if you're not already following me on all my social media, like Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter, you totally should. I will have my usernames over here and the links down below. I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!